check out my brand new state-of-the-art aquatic machine. This is the Moski. Now, a lot of you are probably asking yourselves, well, what is a Moski? Well, you see, a Moski is kind of like a jet ski, except a Moski is a lot cooler and a lot more practical. You see, with a jet ski, you gotta haul it to the lake on a trailer. Then you put it in the water, and when you're done playing, you gotta put it back on the trailer and take it back out. <laughs> Not with the Moski. You see, I can drive this sucker from my house all the way down the highway, run straight into the water, and come straight back out and ride all the way back home. You see, everything on the Moski is made of the most high-tech and innovative material. All this is fifth generation. You ain't gonna find this on Google or Amazon. As you can see here and here are my aquatic stabilization devices, also known as aqua kegs. Not only do they keep my Moski afloat, but they also stabilize it in high speed situations. You see, these is constructed of the most high grade aluminum alloy. Now I know that these look like poo noodles, but they ain't. You see, these here are my water displacement devices. Not only do they help keep the Moski afloat, but as I am cruising through the water, they help displace the water. The water goes through the hole and out the back, which causes a lot less resistance, allowing the Moski to be much more streamlined while cruising through the water. Now this here is my front end ski. It keeps my front end up out the water as I'm cruising. But when I come up out of the water, as you can tell, my wheel patrols through it right there. So it comes up off the ground, my wheel hits the ground, I take off. And this is my state-of-the-art snorkel. You see, it keeps air going in the motor while keeping water out of the motor. And as you can see here, this is my emergency shut-off valve. If my Moski were to be in the water and it was to start sinking, which it would not do because I built this thing, but let's just say it was to start sinking. I would turn my valve like that right there, which would stop water from getting into my motor. And last but not least, the heart of the beast. Now the Moski has two different engines. It's got a 4,000 cc pushing the tires, and we got this 30 horsepower motor pushing her through the water. Now this motor has five speeds. Now number one, that's cruising mode when I'm going through wake zones. But now five, that's Jesus mode. If I turn it on five, this old Moski here will be walking on the water. <laughs> it's sinking. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, the Moski floats. Not with me on it, but, but it floats. Well, right, we're working on it. Like I said, this is a prototype. Next time you see me, I'll be cruising, man. I'll be riding all around this lake, like that right there on the back car. All right, as y'all can see, this is prototype number two. We've taken the kegs off because the kegs were not buoyant enough. Now, that was my idea. Bobby said that we should have used 55 gallon drums. I just didn't think it would be stylish enough, so we went with the kegs. Horrible idea, okay? This is the first time in two years Bobby has ever been right about something. Uh, so I will I will credit him for that right now. And as you can see, we've got 55 pound barrels. We're popping them bad boys on. That's, I think they can hold like 450 pound a piece, all right? So I should float, even in these hurricane force winds we got. Yeah, we got a hurricane coming. Just make it more fun. That'll break your wrist right yeah. there. The God, blue, the it. blue will fit in there. In the black. All right, I'm on the Moski. I'm headed back down to the lake. Turn it off. Oh, no. Come on. <laughs> it's floating. Where's my boat? I can't reach nothing. I can't reach. <laughs> We're floating, ladies and gentlemen. I'm leaving you. is we 
sonar float. I'm out in the lake. Problem is, I can't reach my trolling motor to turn me around. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I found the fine balance of keeping me out of the water, though. Front end and the back end. I just got to get the trolling motor. I'm just going around in circles right now. But I'm going further out into the water, and I ain't got nothing to pull me back. Dang it, I got to jump in. I know this day was going to come. Go down with my ship. Hey, if we can fix the darn trolling motor to go up. You got your switch on, light switch. We'll be good. Whew. That's cold. Dang it. It floated. It floated. I actually made it out into the lake. I just, uh, I couldn't steer it. I couldn't steer it. But hey, prototype number two is much better than prototype number one. I stayed afloat. I was on there. That's very impressive. You got to admit the most key is very impressive. That second attempt, much better. Now I'm cold, all right? I'm pretty sure I got hypothermia, but I'm on my end, okay? I can take it, all right? But uh, I, I feel much better about it. You know, I just couldn't reach my darn uh, engine, my trolling motor. And I think our uh, flotation devices are set a little bit too far to the front. Uh, we're gonna put them at the back a little more. I'm gonna figure out a way to reach my darn trolling motor. And then I think we'll be good. The Moski will be 100% functional after that. Uh, and then I'll put it into mass manufacturing and everybody can have one. All right, this is it. Attempt number three. I'm hitting dirt. I'm on the ground. Come on, baby. Come on. Oh, oh. That ain't good. Am I going the right way? I think so. Uh oh. Shoot, 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 shoot. I pulled my stick out. Does it feel like it's pushing you? Well, I, I'm hitting the brake. Which way is which way? Probably to that way, like clockwise. Yeah, do that. Now it should be. Is it on? It's on. You're not moving. Unless something's. Oh, oh. Look at how you hit that turbo. Oh, shit. All right, folks, he's uh, stuck. <laughs> I'm moving. All right, straighten her up. I can't. This is the Titanic all over again. What do you Doing donuts on the water? Woo, doggy. Yeah. I'm gonna need heavy D sparks towing down here. Recovery. Uh. Ah! Hey, you can't kind of sit on the seat backwards and reach it. Say, so, you can't sit on the seat backwards and reach it. Like a seesaw. <laughs> All right, you, you're getting further from the bank. I might have to go home and get a fishing rod to catch you. Oh, oh, there he goes, folks. There he goes. He's going down. He is going down. It's all over with. <laughs> Attempt failed. Oh, 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 she's gone. She is gone. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the Moski did not work. Now it's time for me to pick up the pieces, both emotionally and physically. God bless y'all. I love you. So Bobby come down here on the boat ramp to tow me out the water, you know, cause that moped right there is heavy. 
and uh, apparently Bobby is low on gas. And now that he is sitting on an incline like this, his truck will not crank. So now not only is my Mosky stuck down here on the ground, but Bobby's truck is stuck down here on the boat ramp, which means we are stuck way out here in the middle of nowhere. Good times. Good times. God bless y'all. I love you.